the story of the person who set the bar for you way lower than you could possibly set for yourself. It's, it's scary how many people nod at this story of, you know, someone who doesn't know you. Because here I was, top of my class in my high school. I was the class treasurer. I had, to, I, I thought I was doing pretty well in this school. You know, I had a brother that went to Princeton. I had parents who loved me. I had great grades. Um, but I walked into the office of a counselor in a big school who just didn't really know me. She hadn't taken the time to understand me. And I don't know what she did. Maybe she looked at a combination of scores or background or whatever. And she decided that my wish to go to Princeton was, was thinking too big. I was reaching too high. And at that point, she told me, I don't think you're Princeton material. Um, and, you know, and I, I, and I stop here because I, I just sort of want people to take that in because I, I do remember that. You know, those words stung me and they sting me to this day, which is why I always try to be very careful with young people. Uh, how I speak to them and how much encouragement I give to them because those words sat with me like I never was First Lady. When I hear them to this day, they hit me as powerfully as they did when I was young. And fortunately for me, because of that flame that my parents kept lit, I was like, you don't even know me, lady. You have no idea. That's what went through my head. But I think about all the kids who didn't have that foundation that I had and who would take those words and they would sing smaller for themselves. They would, <laughs> they would step a little more softly, that it would have defeated them. For me, because I was stubborn, my fo focus was, I'll show you. I will show you. I will, I will make you eat those words. And so, Young people, what I had to do was move away from somebody that didn't believe me and find the people who did, because there were many around me who did. There were other teachers and other faculty.